Good morning. Today is Tuesday and it is about half past eight. We've had a bit of a, a lay in this morning. Um, Matt's already seen a dolphin jumping out of the side of us, so he's out on dolphin watch at the moment. Uh, we're just going to go to the restaurant for the first time for breakfast and then I think we're going to go and watch the architecture man do another talk and um, I don't know what else we've got planned today, but then we're going to Sindhu tonight. Uh, last night, by the way, I think I've just said it, but the glass house was incredible. Truly, truly phenomenal food and highly recommend that. So, the weather looks fantastic. Fingers crossed it stays like this. Here's some dolphins. OMG. Oh my god, it's so tight. Oh, you blooming beauties. Oh, can you see the sun, Matt? Just sit in the ocean over there on the horizon. There's so many dolphins playing around today. In the atrium now, we were going to the architectural talk, however we forgot that he was doing it an hour early. So we've missed that. Instead, we've come to the atrium. And I'm reading my Duno handbook. And Matt's reading... Matt, what are you reading? House of Fortune, Jesse Burton. Sounds a laugh. Good afternoon. It's now 4 p.m. on Tuesday, the sea day. Um, we had a little downpour of rain earlier that lasted about five minutes. It was hilarious watching everyone dart from the um, sun loungers to take cover, but then the sun's come straight back out. Um, we haven't really done anything. We've just read, played cards, and chilled. Um, Matt's just gone to Iron, ready for Sindhu tonight. I cannot begin to describe how excited I am about Sindhu. Everyone we speak to that's done P&O cruises talks about Sindhu, so I just hope it lives up to that expectation and I've not, I've not built it up too much in my head. Um, and then afterwards, we're gonna go to Havana Bar watch a bit of music and then Pulse, the band on board, is doing Motown and Soul. If it's not to our liking, we're going to come back and watch a bit more uh, Netflix or whatever that we've downloaded. And then tomorrow we dock in Vigo and we're going to the Compostela de Santiago or something like that. It's the massive pilgrimage church. So. We're really, really looking forward to that. Why not? Here we are in Sindhu. This is the recipe. Ed menu, sorry, not the recipe. <laughs> We're not cooking. And there's Matt. Cheers. So this is in Sindhu. Quite a nice, classy restaurant, I'd say. We're just waiting for the waiting staff to come and take our order. These are the cutest poppadoms and pickles I've ever seen. Matt's never had a poppadom, so he's going to try one. These are the lamb chops with feta. And this is the beef, Kerala beef with parappa. So there's Matt's lamb shank, some lentil dals potato, basmati rice, some paratha, and then my mixed curries with saffron rice. Yummy, yummy, yummy. We've finished in Sindhu now, and we've just had five minutes to debrief. We thought the starters were excellent, both of us. The mains were... All right. We're going to say all right, yeah. We don't know if it's our fault, though, because we've built it up so much. 
that actually it was never going to live up to that expectation. So if it is, then that is our own problem. And we've brought it on ourselves. But it was okay. Uh, we're now just on the promenade and we've come for a little walk. As you can see, it's a stunning evening. And then we're going to decide what we're doing tonight, whether we're still going to the Motown stuff or whether we're going to go and chill. But we have done a lot of chilling today. <laughs> My heart rate got to 58 in the restaurant. Well, we decided to just come back and read our Horizon magazine for tomorrow. Sorry, there you go. And watch a bit of TV in the room. We're up fairly early again in the morning for the excursion. So I'll say good night and we'll see you tomorrow for Ah, Santiago de Compostela. Good morning. morning. Today is Wednesday, the 13th of September, and we've arrived in Vigo. Apparently, the sun's not coming up until, is it nine o'clock? Oh, quarter past eight. And it's only 7.40 at the minute. So it's just starting to get lighter. Today we are going to Santiago de Compostela and we're excited. So we're just going to head for breakfast now. And here we are with the snack. And we're off. Just in front of us is the Queen Victoria, which is a Cunard. Seven. Well, it was expected for the fifty-three, mm. but anyway, forty-seven is just a, a big uh, group. Mm. And until Obradoiro Square, we have the way. So it's St. Francis of SCC is actually right. A monk, the founder of Franciscan monks. We only had uh, about 20 minutes inside, but it was nice and peaceful. We didn't go have time to go past the actual relics of the Apostle Air James, but we saw where people were going, and then we've got ourselves a nice guidebook. We 
now on free time, so we've just come from to let's go until we go and get a coffee break. Uh, we've just stood in front of the cathedral for about 20 minutes and it was so cool watching all the pilgrims arrive. Like they're all running and hugging and kissing and it's just, it's actually really emotional watching them all because they've done such an amazing achievement. It's just wicked. It does make us want to do one. Just where to and when. We're in our free time still. And just walking around this garden. Now we're going into some refreshments in this five star hotel, which is exciting. It's like a banquet hall, man. Like a big banquet hall. Max enjoying himself from peach. And some shortbread. And I've got a pineapple juice. sail in about five minutes. We really enjoyed our excursion, didn't we Matt? Yeah, it was really good. And now there's a seagull just chilling out there, look. He wants to come with us. <laughs> it's a lovely place though, here. Mm. This is what the north of Spain is like, like the whole way about it, all very green. But it rains a lot, so we've been really lucky the last couple of days. Just about to make our plans for tonight, um, which will involve food and then some entertainment. And then tomorrow we are in Lisbon, where we're docking for two days. <laughs> <laughs> She took her balls off too, did she? Oh, she did. Oh, 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 fuck out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. You were both naked. I was naked. Liz was naked. The cabin steward. <laughs> 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 what was he doing there? How did you get your witches? <laughs> <laughs> Gareth Oliver was funny. Here's the sunset. Master's doing some photos for people because the sunset's so nice. <laughs> <laughs> 